Okay, so we're on here. We switch. Oh, damn. Nothing happened. Hmm, you can make it from the top rung as well. If, if you, you know, if you time it correctly. Okay, okay. My, my bad, my fuck up. Wow. Alright, well, back to the drawing board. God damn. I'm not leaving until we badge. I'm not leaving until we badge. We do fire first. Shit. A lot of failure. So far, so good. We can just get patterns like that all the time, that'd be nice. Refill, please. The big one. Big boy. Big yellow jug of piss. Gumdrop, thanks. doesn't mind. He loves it. He loves it. Cut. Messing up. Mm. 
That's alright. Because in my heart... I know that I can badge. Deep down my heart... I knows it. Ooh. Gimme. Mmm. Delicious. I don't think I can reach that. Big jump. Thank you. Thank you, kind sir. Cut man, elect man t two times, huh? I mean, I, I demonstrated in the beginning of the VOD that I could do the jump and guts man, it's just I don't want to at this stage. So I demonstrated competency, okay? I didn't with Iceman, but I have done it in a previous stream. Two seconds, I'm gonna sneeze. Four times, not bad. Oh, the Bluminos soon, but yeah. It's not like I'll use the lives. It's just, you know, force of habit, I guess.
Boo, 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 boo. Suck my dick. Oh, you see? Sometimes it's not automatically uh, a huge jump. Sometimes it's a small leap onto the ladder there. Sometimes. Okay. Big jump. Fuck you. Baby. Two seconds. Elec Mang. Feel like a big goofus, big big goof and a doofus for effing up at the gutsman stage like that. In my defense, you required knowledge that I had yet to possess. In my defense. Oh, 
Big jump, big jump, big jump. You hate to see it. Mm. I saw uh, Chrono Gear was trying to do the, um, the revised Zombies They My Neighbors set. And I was just like, that's an already tough game, like, good luck with that, holy shit. That would be a highly coveted badge if you could get it. Mm 
Spooky. Don't mess up, Aaron. I know, I know. And yet? And yet? Here, just need to be a little bit more careful than what I was last time. There we go. Now get to the second bit. All right. Finish. Try to get, try to get this um this life. But if you can't, it's all right. Good boy. He didn't really need to, to do that, but like, you know, good boy. Um, now next. Um... Gutsman, so he's allergic to fire? No, bombs. So I have bombs. Let's just keep it on flame then. Oh, big jump thingy, oh! Big jump, big love, mm, big kiss. Mm. Yoink. Whoa, what the fuck was that? Have you ever seen that? Like a double life drop? Wow. It doesn't matter how many lives we collect, like, we can't lose a single life. So. I guess we just, just chuck... Three bombs will kill him. Change back. Just to make it easier. Make it a little bit easier. Now 
There we go. Now check this out. Jump. 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 And then it's uh, off screen. It's a nice little strat that you can do. Alright. Now here. Moment of truth. Okay. Nice. Should be enough. Fuck. Do you see how the game actively conspires to fuck you? Stuff. Because, like, um, you can't just, like, auto-swap with some of these weapons. Some of them have, like, a horrendous delay. Magnum Beam being one of them. Like, the beam has to, be, like, actually disappear from the map before you're allowed to get back in the menu weapon again. You can't just, like, go... <sighs> so, that can be very stressful. But anyways... Let's see... Okay, my tip here... Get that half foot... No. Okay, it didn't work. Very situational one, anyway. Now, Fireman is allergic, let's just say, to electric beam. But that's already full up. Okay, we just have to um, get a, a nice dodge from uh, Big Sun. No. Did not want to cooperate. I might just camp here for a little bit. Oh, okay. No, the, the game is giving me everything I want. Oh, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. Gave me full uh, energy tank. Yeah, that's beautiful. Alright. One electric beam. I guess PB for this run was uh, getting to copy robot and then getting fucked up. We've learned our lesson. It's going to be magnet beam and then we're going to chuck an electric beam. And we're just going to like sap him of like everything that he's got. We're also going to try to get there with, with absolute max health if we, if we can. Nice. Thank you. Thank you. The um, guts arm or the electric beam can deal with this. Now, with the buster only run, you have to like get through this without using the ice beam to freeze the, the panels. So, it's not nice. Not nice. And here, switch to electric beam. Because it shoots in three directions, up, down, and across. Like that. Electric beam or guts arm, it doesn't matter. Let's get this obstacle out of the way. Switch back to electric beam. You can just fall down here. Kill. You wait here, wait on this platform. The other two, no. Okay, this next one is a little bit tricky. A little bit tricky. As we demonstrated last time. Because they're they're in cahoots with each other to fuck you over. Do you see this whole shittery? Okay, that's nice. 
once you get to the other side, it's like, okay, oh, I can breathe again. You just gotta know when to hold them, when to fold them. Okay, electric beam. Yeah, we got more than enough. Yellow Demon is fucked. His weakness is electricity. Now you've got to do the dance. Three jumps, then a big jump, and then two more jumps. One, two, three, big jump. Fucked up that time. I could have, like, gone another phase of that, of dodging the blocks, but, yeah, you, you don't, you don't want to put up with this guy. Alright. One. Two. Three. Speedrun tactics. <laughs> Very risky, I know. I shouldn't have done that. Boom. 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 Sometimes the delay there, like when he explodes, Wolf F you over because if he's already thrown his um pair of scissors at you, he'll get just that little bit closer and like you're you're basically stunned. So you have to be very careful uh when you're trying to set up the last shot to kill him. Because you, you don't want to obviously be anywhere near that if you're doing a damageless run. So uh, switch to elect Boom. Oh, don't mind if I do. Don't mind if I do. Uh, for which one? Gutsna. Yeah, for Elec. Thank you. Now, we've also got some goodies there. So just to, you know, guarantee it, rather than fall through the floor, we'll do that for the Guts Arm. Sorry, like I forgot, um, like I said, mentioned before, you can't switch out of the magnet beam until the beam disappears, so, yeah, it's alright. Okay, now, next up will be Elec Man, so we're gonna use the cut weapon, and we're gonna, gonna cut him up, we're gonna cut him up real good. Good night. Uh, now this next bit here, um, it doesn't matter what you do. So just go put it back to Buster, I guess. Um, you have to avoid the um, explodey bits that come out of the ground. You saw them in the Cutman level. Drop down here. Avoid. But don't be slow. Keep going. Back it up. Back it up. There we go. Alright. Uh, we can use the Magnet Beam, like I said, to get the, the life. I don't need it, but I'll just, you know. So you've got enough time to get that. Electric Beam is your friend. Uh, yeah, good, good, good. And once again, and again. Am I nervous about the boss? Yes. Because he's 
difficult to cheese. He does not want to be cheesed. Now, do I honestly need that? I might as well get it, though. Or, look, I don't... Look, I'm not going to die, right? It's not on the card, right? My Elect Beam... Mm. Oh, that'll, that'll be, like, what? 15, 20 shots. That's more than enough. I don't need 15, 20. If I do, then I'm dead. Boom. Oops, forgot about that. Remember? Magnet to push him away. And then... It's all on the pause glitch. You can do this legit. There are cheese strats for this boss, which I employed. Um, but again, this run, we're, we're basically, on, basically on the... Uh, the premise of not losing a life. So. Definitely the roughest boss. With that out of the way, the road should be clear for the badge. He is um, definitely the, the most annoying one. But now that we can do the um, pause glitch, or the rest of the shit, it's no worries. This boss I would consider to be a cakewalk as well. Even like with just not using any weapons, just buster only. Okay, but what you want to do here, is you do want to land on the far side here. So you want to land on the far side. That will give you this ledge to stay on for the, the next three screens. Then you got to like go towards the boss. Um, so here it just gives you a little bit of a breather, figure out what you want to do. There we go. There's uh, a screwdriver underneath you, but he's not going to hurt you. Boom. Boom. Alright. Now switch back to this one. You kind of want to keep it on this one, and then, like, trust that you're going to kill this thing outright. Um, okay, I've got full life. You want to make sure that you have full life, just to guarantee. Um, this one... This one, I feel like, um... You don't want to be relying on the weapons. You want to be relying on your... Um... Your default weapon for the first three phases of this fight. There are seven phases. The other four you'll be using your guts arm to throw the block um, at the thing, which is its weakness. And if you miss, you've still got a leg beam. And pause trick. So. Okay, here. Now, you can jump, but I prefer with the penguins, just shoot. You get some goodies. You might need the goodies. It's all random, though. 
Now there should be six of them. Yep. The rest are these uh, bomber things that you don't want to touch. Because shooting them will explode them. They'll mess up your, um, you know. Jump here. Ah, oh, okay. So it's, it's a sketchy one, that one. Alright. And once you get here, it's good luck. Stay in this corner here. Okay, that was good. Again? Okay, good, good, good. Okay, switch over to Guts. Okay, that was legit. That was legit damageless as well. That was nice. <clears throat> there's, there's no real trickery you can do with that one as well. Okay, this one's... You know, you just gotta be wary. Um, like with the Elect Man stage, you'll get the, uh, the three green things on either side. On this screen and on the next one. I think it's, like, if you're me, you just wait on this platform here. You don't fuck around and you try to preemptively kill them. Okay. Uh, again, I prefer a much riskier strat of jumping from the initial platform. But I'm no way gonna risk that now. Alright. Most of the main danger is now gone. Can I get that? Is yes. You don't have to do what I'm doing here, but I just like to do it. Now here is you know, it's an instant death trap. But, if you've got your Magnet Beam... Okay. You don't want to jump on it once it's going that way. You want it to come back and you just want to drop off the ladder. Like that. Get that. Drop onto that. That will give you a full refill. Back here. You're done. Now, here, you can farm lives. So, you could um, retreat back with the Magnet Beam, then come back here, get another life, another full refill, rinse, repeat, and you can get your lives up to 99, if that's what you want to do with your time. Uh, but that's not me. Now, there's a gauntlet of four enemies. It's going to be um, Bomb Man, which is uh, weak to fire. So we're going to be going there with fire. After Bomb Man is um, Fire Man. So he's the breather boss. So you know his pattern. He's very easy. You can kill him with just your Buster weapon, uh, which is probably what I'm going to do as well. Next you have um, Ice Man, who is weak to electricity. So again, we're going to do the pause trick, electricity right through. Last guy is uh, Guts. He can be tricky. Um, however, his weakness is the bomb, so I'm gonna throw one bomb at him, and then pause streak. So I shouldn't get hit. And then after that, it's just Wily, who I'm gonna use the pause streak on. Because fuck Wily. Um, he's very susceptible to fire. But I'm wondering, do I do fire, or do I do electricity? I guess we'll cross that bridge when we get there. Okay.
Now this guy can really fuck your day up. His his pattern is completely RNG. So what you you you're basically hoping that he does the big jump because then like it gives you time to get to a place, shoot the shot, do the pause trick. Um, but also if you're just trying to do this legitimately, you want him to do that big jump because you want to get as much distance and as much room to move as possible. You don't want to be right up his ass. But yeah, it is what it is. We're just going to do this guy from just all buster. No tricks. It's a bit early on the jump there. Oh, same with that one. Use this as an opportunity just to calm your nerves a bit. This is a nice rhythmic pattern. Your ability to jump in time will be, you know, practiced here. Once he's on his last two, you can shoot with the buster. Now that's gone. Electric beam, Iceman. You want to jump a bit. Like that. Because that's what he'll do. Boom. Now, that ice beam, if that hits you, that's like um, a third of your health. So, you know, it is, you know, you, you do want to avoid that shit. Alright. Let's get that bomb going. Needs another one, gritty shit. Get hit by the bomb cunt. Damn it. Damn it. Well, not ideal. Um, I'm hoping that this is enough for um, for Wily. Why do I keep saying Robotnik? Okay, here you'll get a refill, one last refill. Um, obviously we don't need it for bombs. Um, which guns are pretty much useless? Ice Beam I find completely useless. Guts Arm, useless. Electric Beam, situationally, especially the second phase, you might find it easier to hit the, the bauble on the second phase from underneath the ship. I don't. Once you recognize the pattern, like you hit it and then you, you run into the, the ship a little bit. In other words, you go to the right of where you shoot. And then the then Wily's shot should like circle over your head. And it's just rinse repeat. Um, again, like, he's weakest to fire, so likely your best bet. Also, on the first phase, if you get right up in his grill, the circle bit, that really messes him up. Like, when, when it's circling around your, bo your body. Um, and M, yeah, again, this has no use in the fight. Um, some people will simply feel more comfortable using the, um the buster because it seems like when you use the fire you might feel like um a bit stronger than what you actually are you see because at the very beginning of the fight he starts in the middle of the screen and he actually pinces you in the left and he's he throws some he lobs some bullets and you're really under a lot of pressure during that particular stage of the fight he then backs away and once he's backed away then you can really fuck him up um, and it's far easier to dodge the bullets but in the very initial part of the um the fight no it's it's very hairy okay now i believe i have enough health to tank a couple of the small ones i'm not sure how many of the big boy ones in phase two i can tank probably about 
to maximum. If he gets me with a third, I'm probably fucked. But I'm hoping the poor Strix is going to help me here. Alright, enough explaining. Boom, boom, boom. We got a million points. Wow. And that's how you badge Mega Man. And that's how you badge Mega Man, boys. Yeah. Watch them pop. I said, watch them pop. We finally got there. You really see this? Thank you, Skidaddle, thank you. I think that deserves an explosion. 